Hi there, Gemini. I'm here to get you some tarot messages for today. Let's look into the energies of your person. We'll see what's going on with your person. What do these cards have to say today? I feel like there's the full moon. Uh, the full moon is near as I am um, pulling these cards. Uh, I feel like the full moon is somehow affecting your person. Uh, let's just see where these cards take us. What's the message here? Uh, we have King of Sword, Nine of Wand, Five of Cups, Nine of Cups, Empress, Queen of Wand, Hermit, Tower Energy. All right. So I feel like your person has been trying to get over something, trying to clear their mind, trying to make a change. Uh, but they want to, they want to make the right changes. Like they don't want to make a mistake. Maybe they made decisions in the past that um, that brought them disappointment. Um, and they don't want to repeat history. Um, but the universe is is bringing in fresh energy for your person. Um, open up and allow it is what these cards are saying. Uh, your person definitely wants to be with you. What they're most desiring right now is the Empress. Um, they they want like a deeper connection with you, regardless of your gender. You know, they want that nurturing energy that you possess. They they want to share that energy with you, that, that warming, nurturing, caring energy. Um, maybe they weren't... Um, gosh, they, there's something about your energy that is so admirable and so beautiful and so inspiring. Um, and yet they feel like uh, they close themselves off from your energy or or maybe you closed your energy off from your person. Maybe they um, failed to offer you what you needed in the past. And now they're realizing the error of their ways uh, is what I'm getting here. Uh, but let's clarify this king of sword i feel like there there was a moment of clarity like oh okay i i i know what i must do or maybe there's some sort of aha moment here because what spirit most wants us to know is this tower and your person's current energy is king of swords that feels like a like a, ah i see it now i see i see deeper than i saw before or maybe i see deeper than i allowed myself to see before um, and they're changing their perspective. They're changing the way they feel about their life. They're changing the way they feel about themselves um, and this connection. Uh, I feel like I want to I want to clarify, but I want to pull a card on the King Sword and the Tower because I feel like that first card out and this last card out they're connected. It's like they're they're your person's current energy and what the universe most wants us to know is is this King of Sword Tower energy. So there's an aha moment. Here. Here. Queen of Pentacles. Yeah, they're they're seeing your beauty, your luxury, your your everything. You are everything. You know, you know, the Empress is the queen of all queens. And and they're desiring this Empress. Like they want more of you. They want to share more of your energy, more of your ideas. And yes, it's the Wheel of Fortune on this tower. What Spirit is saying is, yeah, it's time. It's time for the two of you to reconnect, to change your direction here, to um, seek the unknown to figure it out together you know I feel like maybe you've been wondering you know like what's what's the deal with this connection maybe your person has been wondering the same and now it's like it's time to have a discussion like okay what what is it what are we doing here justice yeah let's make this right let's like bring some ease to this um the, the the not necessarily chaos but ease to the overwhelm ease to feeling like we're responsible for everyone else except ourselves um like you me and us here yeah ace of wand here your person wants to begin with you they want to start with you they want to um taste your sweetness they want you know that joy that happiness they want to know you know like what like you, there's something about you that, 
They want to explore. They want to explore all your inner workings. Yeah, there's confirmation here. Yeah, it's like you, the two of you belong together. It's like, okay, we have that justice card and that temperance. It's a, there's a balance here. You fit together perfectly. And it's like your person wants to share every, every inch of you, like mind, body, soul, world. Yeah, there's a full circle moment. There's like the big, um, I'm getting like the big O from that. Like the big, this, this is all circular. Like there's something powerful happening here. And I feel like it's happening behind the scenes. Like the, 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 the things are in motion behind the scenes. There's a new creative energy surfacing here. Yeah. And your person is, is more focused. They're not as um, hmm, distracted by shiny things. Maybe in the past they were distracted by something that led them away from you. And now they're realizing like, Wait a minute. It's like the universe is drawing the two of you back together to re-examine this. Yeah, to make major changes here. Everything is about to transform for you and your person uh, is what I'm getting. Uh, you, you're destined to be together. And that's just what, this, what these cards are saying. You're being shown the way is what I'm getting. All right. Let us close with our Lemurian Oracle message. We have trust your inner sense. Sometimes it can be hard to decipher between intuition and what our mind is telling us. Stories, projections, or fear can arise under the guise of intuition. To distinguish truthful inner guidance from paranoia, we must return to innocence, to our purest essence. Here we have access to the truth of our being. Honesty is more than not lying to yourself. It is also about not withholding and having deep transparency within yourself. Learn to trust and be absolutely honest with yourself. In your heart of hearts, you hold the answers. Notice the first thoughts you have before you second guess yourself. Listen and honor these. Peace be with you. Bye now.